Stop listening to all the negative news and media and social media that the sky is falling. It isn't. Now the market is shifting and I have Cassandra with Clark & Clark Real Estate to talk a little bit about what's going on. Cassandra from the real estate agent aspect, what's going on? Well, we're starting to see a little bit more inventory on the market. We're starting to see homes stay on the market just a little bit longer. And these are good things. They're really good things, right? We have been in a market where we haven't even had a week's worth of inventory. We're starting to see homes on the market. We've seen also a drop in buyers, right? We've seen a 16% year over year drop in the amount of buyers. Now we still have plenty of buyers out there looking, but what does that create? A little bit less competition. I love that. Right? So buyers have a little more of a chance and they maybe aren't doing appraisal gaps quite as large as they were before. They're doing a few things less. But one thing I'm really starting to hear people ask about is what about interest rates? How is this affecting me? How is it affecting affordability? So Josh, can you tell us a little bit about what you're telling your clients when they're asking those questions? Absolutely. The biggest thing is don't panic on interest rates. Uh, there's a cool saying going on out there right now and it's talking about marry the house, date the interest rate. So basically that means lock down the house and when interest rates do come back down, you can do a simple refinance and drop the mortgage payment. So it's not a big deal, do not stress about interest rates. As we sit today, it's early July, mortgage rates are kind of in the mid to high five, so no big deal there. The 25 year average for a mortgage interest rate is 6.75%, so we're still way below. Affordability is up a little bit, so your monthly payment is gonna be a little bit more, but we are seeing less buyers in the market, which is good for you as a buyer. It just means less competition. You're gonna have a better chance to score the home of your dreams. Cassandra, what are some other thoughts for sellers right now? Yeah, one big thing for sellers is make sure that you have the plan. Take the time to maybe put an extra coat of paint on. Make sure that landscaping looks great. Um, I really feel like a lot of the prep work has kind of gone on the wayside the past couple of years. Make sure that your agent is using a photographer and a videographer, that marketing and planning is key. So even if you're thinking of selling within three, six months, we wanna have a conversation and make sure that there's a plan in place. I love it. We talked earlier that proper prior planning prevents poor performance. In the last couple of years, you can put it on the market and it went for the moon. Now we're getting into a more balanced market. So this is gonna be great for sellers. They're still gonna get their dollars and this is a great opportunity for buyers. So connect with us. We're the real estate experts. Josh Nora with Northern Mortgage. Cassandra Clark with Clark & Clark Real Estate. We'll see you soon. Thanks.